What's going on guys, it's Emil here and welcome to Season 14 of Weemfy League. This is Custom Track Division 1, Week 2, Daisy Squad vs Succeeder Parish. First track we have here is Horror Mansion which eh, I'm not really fond of. So I want to try to get an item since I'm in a really bad position. Yeah, that's not really going to help too much. And Russo gets bumped into a wall. Anyway, I want to try to hold these shrooms as long as I can. Because you don't really need them in this section. But the section after is really good for mushrooms. So hopefully... Okay, never mind. Guess we're not going to use mushrooms later. <laughs> anyway, we're bottom two right now. Which isn't really good for this track. Since you, you can break away on it easily if you know how to drive it. Which, as you can see by the minimap, Trevor and Kenny seem to be doing. Now, since it is after 30 seconds, I want to try to obtain a dodge item to dodge a shock later in the race. Which I do, which is good. But, there's no sign of either Bagger having the shock right now. And the top spots are beginning to break away a little bit more from the bottom four runners. Okay, just gotta hold my star a little longer and- OH MY GOD A BOMB! That's not really good. Now we're bottom three, we're falling behind a little more, and the top spots are beginning to break away even more than they already were at the beginning of the race. I, I can't hold my star for too much longer. I'm I'm just gonna go up and chain this. Hopefully I can get another star or a mega. Like, I really need a good item to catch up. Okay, come on, come on. Really? Out of anything you could have given me there, it just had to give me a pow. Anyway, I want to get Luke in midair so he doesn't have to lose his item. Okay, good. More triple shrooms. Awesome. I can catch up. Mike gets back green. This is really good. And stop! Now, you might be wondering why that shock was used. Well, Merc just acquired the shock, and Matt was already using a star, and his star was running out soon. So we knew we had to use it in order to have a chance to catch up to top three. And luckily, Russo was also able to spam a dodge item, so he was able to dodge the shock as well. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to dodge, but this is going to be huge in having Russo and Matt catch up to the rest of the pack. Alright, here comes Russo, X, and Matt to save our race. Now, while I'm back here, I might as well try to get something of my own to get back into the pack. That's... yeah, wow, I'm just not getting any useful items at the right time, am I? Anyway, might as well use this blooper to make sure people can't see and shroom ahead of Trevor. Gotta shroom away from him though, cause I really don't want to risk getting hit by anything he has. Alright, this is a really crucial moment for the race. We're 2-4-5 right now, and Kenny basically has a guaranteed first. The only way we can win this race is if we are able to get Raptor out of second. What's this? Russo uses a star since he had it earlier. Come on, all he has to do is hit him. <gasps> Wait. He got him! He actually got him! Russo X, the saving grace for that race right there. Instead of SOP getting a really good race there, Russo was able to star Raptor, and because of that, we ended up getting 2, 3, 4, 5 for that race. Unbelievable, dude. Alright, next up we have Hell Pyramid. This one's personally one of my favorites, and we chose this because starting in 2-3 allows you to be in a tighter line for the beginning. And, well, that proved pretty effective since I was able to slip into first, having a better line than the first place. Now, right now, what we want to do, we want to try to fend off anyone behind us so we can break away on, the, on this ramp section. It's really easy to get bumped off by Funky Kongs here, so we're trying our best to do what we can. Now, I'm not sure what Raptor was doing here, but he seemed to be rather effective in getting Russo to hit, get hit by something. Ah, Raptor with a shroom in first. Can't really do much about that. Gotta make sure we can get him out of first, though, and right now I have one of my teammates beside me. Raptor seems to be able to hold on to first while I have Luke right behind me. I can't really do much to get Trevor off his back, so I try to snipe Raptor instead. And that green looked like it could have hit Raptor. Would have been cool though, wouldn't it? <laughs> now that time I get both the low tricks, and Raptor must have missed the second one because I was able to slip ahead of him there. Hello, Trevor. Oh my god. <laughs> How did I not get bumped off there? If I got bumped like one more pixel, I would have gotten bumped off. 
Okay, that was like extremely avoidable. So, um, rip. And I definitely could have done something there. Ooh, a little close contact with Luke there. Oh, I didn't expect that banana. But it's okay, we have our shroom. Still keeping third, but Raptor and Trevor are starting to get a little bit of a break. Okay, Raptor, what was that attempt? You can do better than that. A fib. Go for another snipe. Uh, hey, we got him. Let's go. Okay. All I gotta do is try to get Trevor out of first. Ooh. Clean low tricks once again. Let's go. Okay, come on. Give me a red. Give me a red. Nope. I don't know why I went wide there, because I knew Trevor didn't get an item. That's actually really weird. Ooh, I don't know if I'll be able to get Trevor out of first. And I was thinking about letting Luke pass. Oh, that's a Nana. That almost, like, completely killed my driving line. Ugh, just a low trick. That's not gonna be good. <sighs> no, Luke. This is really bad. SOP has 1-3-4 now, and they're looking like they're gonna win their- Where did that fib come from? And how did that not hit me? Okay, come on. I gotta keep second. Oh, that's a really good shock for Kenny. Come on, I can get... What? That's one. That's two. That's a top four from SOP. That was actually unbelievable. Their shock at the end, TS Matt across the ramp, which is why Kenny was able to pass him, since Kenny stopped before the ramp. And it seems like Mike and Trevor were able to get power items such as shrooms or perhaps dodged and were able to catch up to us at the very end. And of course the fact that I got blued because how else are you going to take out the number one North American CT player, you know? Alright, next up we have Neo Koopa City, or, well, 3DS Neo Bowser City, however you know it. This is another really beautiful track that I like, and unlike a lot of tracks in CTGP, this one's fairly balanced for both Daisy and Flame Runner. And right off the bat, I don't know what I was thinking, I should have used my Shroom to go through the cut, but instead, since I decided not to, I ended up paying the price by hitting one of Luke's Reds. But being in the back isn't a bad thing on this track. I'm still in the mix of things and I chained my shroom and huh, pretty good chain right there. <laughs> nice old triple shrooms. I can't really do much with them in this area though. So, oh, Raptor just got killed and Matt's coming up. Okay, this is pretty all right for now. Mike and Kenny are a little bit away from our pack, but we're getting, we're gaining on them quite easily. Got to shrimp through the cut right here. Make sure I don't bump into Luke. And right good. Oh, hello. That's a fib. <laughs> oh, if I didn't... If Luke didn't call that out, I probably would have hit that. Just because, you know, I have pretty good reaction time and everything. So, you know, simple as that. That's a wide nana. And... Oh. Alright, lap two shock. Dodging Trevor. Oh, see you later, Russo. <laughs> This still is pretty good though. Even though all of SOP is up here, we're still pretty close. Yeah, let's try back spamming this guy right here. No? Okay. Well, this is still pretty good. Luke and I are in 3-4 and that's another Nana. <laughs> Easily went inside of it because, you know, we got really good lines and all that stuff. Nothing new there. Ooh, gotta remember that fib. Another really close call. And come on, give me something good. Huh, would you look at that? A TC you can hold. You know what, let's pass it to Kenny for all his effort in being in first place. Now you're probably wondering about why I was able to hold my TC, because this match is being played with TC auto fire disabled, meaning that you can hold TCs and use them whenever. Anyway, here we go, final stretch, two, three, four. <gasps> oh my God, Luke! He got him on the line, that is a top three for Daisy Squad. Absolutely unbelievable ending right there. Oh my goodness. After that last race on Hell Pyramid, we really needed this track to come back. Absolutely outstanding. 
Ah, the vibes of the jungle. Always loving Jungle Cliff. Not a lot of people like to pick it though because it has a great factor of luck. But, there is one way you can break away in first on this. And that's why this track's really fun. And, well, I got the item that I needed to do that. And, of course, Raptor would have triple reds. I can't let him red me. Now then, let's take a mushroom from this Goomba over here and get ourselves into first. All according to plan. Now then, we have Matt and I up here, but obviously it's really easy for people to come back up. That's why I'm going to try to get items to fend off anyone besides myself and Matt. A banana. That's not going to help me with fending people off. But, I can still keep my first. And... Le let's pretend you guys didn't see that. Anyway, fourth place. What can I get here? Um... That's not a good item, but I can just use it right away. That's good, because I'd rather have something else to help me take the cut, and Mike is really close with triple greens. Stay away from me! Okay. We're able to avoid him barely, but that's really good, because we're still gonna get the Shroomba either way. Oh my gosh! That was a little too close for comfort. For some reason, my drift didn't want to register right at that moment, so I drifted way later, and because of that, I almost didn't get to take the shortcut at full speed. But these spots are really good right now. Gonna let Raptor pass to get a strong item. And that is the best item you can get on this track. Now I just gotta hold it until next lap. Or not. Alrighty then. Uh, this is not good. I'm a little far behind compared to the rest of the pack for the end of lap 2. And a POW isn't going to help me. But, this shock, however, is going to do something. Now, the reason that shock was used was because Matt and Russo were before the first set of items, so they could possibly get shrooms. Meanwhile, I got the best item again, the golden mushroom, and this time I know for sure I'm not losing it. This is going to get me all the way up to second, and Luke's also on his way back up too, since he was able to get a power item after the shock. Now our spots are looking really good, and the pack in the back is looking close as well, meaning we're likely to get top spots this race. Now, banana snipe! That was kind of pathetic. <laughs> nice try, Kenny, but that fib's not going to hit me. <gasps> a blue! Dude, this race is going to be so good! Oh, that's some blue shell lag. Dude, is Luke getting second? That's a top two! And I don't know why they used another shock at the end there. It didn't really benefit them too much. They might have been trying to help Trevor, but unfortunately, Trevor still got seventh in the very end. Either way, that race could have gone a lot better in terms of our bottom positions, but getting top two on that track after being behind so much is absolutely unbelievable. Alright, who's up for some Mario Kart 8? We have GBA Mario Circuit Remake by Ethan Mark. Now, it's possible to break away if you get the beginning right, but, you know, gotta get really bumped by Funky Kongs, because that's just what a daisy's for. Alright, now then. Okay, not getting a box. Looks like I won't be able to get up to the rest of the pack for the first half of the lap. Oh my god! That would have been really bad if I got redded by Luke again. <laughs> okay. I thought he was going to take my box again, so I just prepared for the worst, and yeah, I don't know why I slowed down there. And I'm not getting a box here either way, so it's not really going to be much help. Hey, Mike, don't bother trying that. You're not going to pass me a TC. <laughs> good one. Alright, come on, something good. Okay, mushroom's good. I can catch up to top two a little bit with this upcoming cut. Now it's got a red going from him. Hopefully that'll hit. Nah, I decided to go through the cut. I really just missed that box, didn't I? <laughs> That's a big rip. Now I'm going into lap 3 itemless, so... Anything can happen here at this point. And... Okay, any back spam? No? No back spam? Alright, Russo's coming up. Come on, give me something good here. Something good. Oh my god, Mega, let's go! No, that Nana! Uh, why didn't I go for that boost panel? I wouldn't have lost as much time. Either way, I can take the cut, cut here. Oh my god, Luke! Oh, shoot. That was way too close. <gasps> Go, triple shrooms. Come on, Russo. That's all you. 
Is that a 1-3? I can't tell. That was way too close. Dude, come on. That was such a close ending. And Luke got a pretty good spot, too. That was unbelievable for the amount of time that we spent in the back. Really good comeback from all of us right there. It would have been a lot better if I didn't hit that banana on the U-turn, though. Either way, still a really good race, and we probably won that one. Come on. Did Russo get first? I gotta know. This is, like, crucial for this race. Come on. Yes! 1, 3, 5, 6. That's a really good race, considering the fact that there was no shock used. Amazing. Alright guys, for the last race of the video, we're gonna have N64 Banshee Boardwalk, another really good track, but daisies can get absolutely demolished on this track. But, you know, with some lines, you can probably avoid that. Okay, come on, can I get something to get Trevor out of first? Retro, go! Uh, of course I'm gonna get punished. Okay, that's... Oh, yeah, I really just missed the stand so many turbo. Wow, I'm really just choking it today. Alright, come on, something good to get up. Okay, triple shrimps. Gotta avoid loot. Make sure I don't bump him off. Good, good. Oh, man. We got Madden first already. Hopefully, he can hold that. Meanwhile, we got all our Daisy players back here. Okay, come on, something good. Nice, a star. Okay, hopefully, I can hold this because I really need a dodge to get back up there. Okay, that was a really predictable red, Kenny. Oh, no, he's stopping with the mark, isn't he? Um, what? Yeah, that's the first time I've ever had that happen to me. And hopefully the last as well. Okay, gotta really come back and... Yeah, that doesn't help. Thank you, Mr. Bagger, for bumping me into a wall and making me lose all my momentum. Anyway, gotta get something to come back here. Okay, triple shrooms. That'll partially help. Not very much. Hopefully I get something better up here. Come on. Okay, star. But I don't really need to hold it or anything. I might as well use it. Because I'm really far behind compared to the rest of the pack. Meanwhile, Matt's holding first. So he's like our shining light to win this race. Meanwhile, Russo, Luke, and I are bottom three runners. Okay, a golden's really good for catching up. But uh, is it going to end? Nah, dang it. Alright, looks like I got to really do a lot to come back. And Luke's got a TC. Oh, no, dude. This isn't what we need. We got Matt up there just like being a god. Meanwhile, we're all back here just sucking it up. Aw, oh, dude, our item luck's not doing too good. Okay, a golden's really good for this part of the track. Just gotta hold it for a couple more seconds. Well, might as well just use it now. No point holding it anymore, dude. Really gotta make a move to get back into the pack. Uh, Mike's got a red. Dude, no. Please. I'm, I don't want anything to do with that red. I'm just going out of my way to avoid that. Dude, yes, a golden. I really need to use as well. Okay, he backed through red. And Russo threw a blue because, well, Matt finished and it's probably going to hit the guy in second. Come on. Oh, no. Russo barely missed it, dude. That's really not good for this race. We really needed a good race since this was one of the last two and we were down going into it. That's really bad. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. GG's to succeed or perish. I'll see you in the next WL match. And I hope you guys enjoyed this series. I'm definitely looking forward to uploading more Clan War analysis videos. But yeah, as you can see here, this was the 11th race in the Clan War. And race 12 didn't go very well either. If you guys want to see more about Mario Kart Wii custom tracks and competitive Mario Kart Wii, I'll leave a link in the description to the competitive Mario Kart boards. Anyway, I'll see you guys later. Peace out.